Hey everybody, it's Faith from Firesign Tarot. I hope everyone is well. So, a rare occurrence has happened today. I have the house to myself. All day. I know, right? Crazy. So, <laughs> I've decided to take this opportunity to throw some cards down. And get some readings done. Because... This doesn't happen anymore. All right. Aquarius, the universe has decided that you are next in line. So let's get them thrown down for you. Heavenly Father, Mother Earth, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides, Archangels. Thank you for being here with me today. I ask that you give me the clarity of mind and the peace of heart to give the messages to Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, that they need to hear. Thanks again for being here. I appreciate you and I'm grateful for the blessings that you have bestowed upon me. May I pass those blessings down to Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Okay, one to show, one to go from the Wisdom Oracle. Come to the edge. One will save to the end. I didn't see it. Okay. Come to the edge, number 36. If I can find 36. Courage, taking a leap of faith, overcoming fear and accepting risk. Facing the unknown is the only choice you really have right now. If you want to progress, it's okay to be afraid. Now is the time to take risk that is not calculated. To feel the exhilaration as you ready yourself for a leap of faith. Spirit is present, so let go of fear. You are called to express your true self. Listen to your heart and soul, not your head. Come to the edge and discover that you can fly. You must step into unfamiliar so that you may find your miracles. Okay. Oh, what are we going to read with today? Oh. I'm feeling the wizards. We're going to read from the wizards. Sorry, I didn't have my cards out. <laughs> okay. Ah, oh, fire, earth, air, water, speak truth. Fire, earth, air, water, speak truth. One more ought to do it. Is cute, it flipped. Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. King of Swords Reverse. Three of Wands, Queen of Wands, Ten of Swords, wow. In the moon. Queen of Pentacles. Hmm.
That's strange. This feels like the longest minute and a half ever. But something painful finally came to an end. And now there's the unknown. What's on the edge of the cliff? The sun finally came out, but what's on the edge of the cliff? What's up with this King of Swords reversed? Seven of Pentacles. <laughs> what? Okay, Ten of Pentacles reversed. Something didn't work out. There was patience. Waiting. Two cards of waiting. Why is the Three of Wands here? Okay. Could have been financial, but it was like a moment of hard truth. Cut off in communication or half truths. Something came to an end. Something got you stuck. And it's like you waited, you waited it out. You waited for the moment, for the opportunity. To give a cup. Knight of Cups. One more on that Three of Wands. One more on that Three of Wands. The Hermit. Oh. Walk in the path process, inner growth. This was a long time. I think you waited a long time. You had inner work you had to do before I could give this cup to somebody. Could have been a Virgo. I just got Pisces on the board and Who's this Queen of Wands? Could be a Sagittarius. Oh, shoot. That flipped right out. You don't mess with the Queen of Wands. Especially if you keep her waiting. Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. One more. Knight of Swords reversed. Shut down. They already moved on. Six Swords, bottom of the deck. They'd already moved on. I feel like you waited too long, Aquarius. I feel like you waited too long. But that's okay. That's okay. Because you did some inner work. Give me one more on that. Two swords. 
the painful decision. Maybe they had to make a painful decision. No matter what sword comes down, somebody gets cut. Why is the Ten of Swords here? This is the end of something very long, arduous, painful. Two cards came out. Magician reversed. Four of Pentacles reversed. Let go. Why the Magician reversed? Can't manifest. Can't manifest. Weapons down. Seven wands reversed. No fight left in me. Oh, wow. Ten swords reversed, bottom of the deck. Maybe it's a lack of forgiveness. Ace of Wands reversed. I'm not beating a dead horse. There's nothing new starting here. It's over. Ten swords reversed. At, no, eight swords reversed at the bottom of the deck. They've, they've let this go. It's time to move forward. Just let go. And yeah, you might be moving on into the unknown, but at least you know where you stand with this. Why is the moon here? Queen of Swords upright. The devil. Hmm. The acknowledgement of a connection. wands. Sun reversed at the bottom of the deck. I feel like a conversation is definitely going to take place. Why they stopped waiting. Yes, there's definitely, there's a, there's a connection here. A very powerful soul connection. And once you soulmate, you soulmate through the ages to eternity. But don't hold your breath in this lifetime. Sun reversed. Seven cups reversed. Six pentacles. Page of swords reversed. Yeah. Eight swords reversed. Oh, that stinks. the balancing of karma. I feel like you coming forward definitely balances things out. It feels like closure. This feels like closure. Queen of Pentacles, the Fool, Justice, Nine Cups, yeah. Five Swords, Four of Cups at the bottom of the deck here. I feel like with this closure, you can finally step off the battlefield. 
Queen of Pentacles, Nine Cups, Justice, Balance, New Ventures with the Fool. It's, it's the end of a process. You can finally come to the edge and move forward with the rest of it. I don't know how long this took to play out, but I think there's better things coming for you. But I feel like this is why. That cup's behind you on the shelf. You didn't see it. You never turned your head. You just stared at the other three cups. Maybe they were empty, maybe they were full, but you didn't see it. The tribe. This is an interesting card, friends. Eight. Community, belonging, being seen and understood by others, like-minded connections, a sense of family and friendship, knowing your place in the world. This card signals a new affiliation with a group. Humans are social creatures. We need to know. We are useful to our tribes, families, and communities. In a tribe, everyone has an important function and feels, I matter. Membership in the group provides a sense of belonging, of kinship, and of purpose that comes from working together for greater fulfillment of all. Perhaps you are part of a spiritual community or an artistic one. Perhaps you are in a learning community where you share your love of education. Regardless of its former focus, your community brings joy to you. You will be inspired by it and want to contribute to it. Your contribution may be as small as showing up or as large as becoming its leader. No matter your position in the tribe, your presence is needed. I feel like by allowing the closure of whatever this is, you move forward to something else, something better. Coming to the edge, taking the leap of faith. Maybe finally finding your tribe, finding your place. But you gotta look behind you. Finally disconnect from whatever this was. Where it won't manifest. All right, Aquarius. Hope that helped. Know that you loved. Be blessed. Thanks for coming by. And I'll catch you next time. Whatever next time may be.